What up everybody, John Anthony from John Anthony Lifestyle. I want to make a really quick video here. Um, I have some coaches and students arriving in about five minutes, so I don't have time to set up my camera. But I wanted to touch on a topic having to do with compliance, persuasion. I'm gonna make a more complete video on compliance. It's the core of my model. Um, mystery actually ironed out a lot of that stuff in his book, Revelations and a mystery method where he talks about how you get a compliance test, which can be an open, it can be um, an attempt to make out, to isolate, to pull a girl, whatever it may be, and she can either comply or not comply. If she doesn't comply, you give indicators of disinterest and then build up more value and retest, okay? Um, but I, before we continue, please like and subscribe below if you have not already. Okay, so I want to announce some new tour dates. Uh, we're gonna be running either a seven day or a 10 day in Las Vegas. Okay, that's gonna be coming up. Um, let's see. I think it's gonna start May 31st through June 9th, okay, or June 7th. It's gonna start on that Friday. It's gonna either go through to that Thursday night for the seven day or continue on to that Sunday. Okay, so the 10 day will cover two separate weekends. It's gonna be a bunch of night game in field where you're gonna have the instructor going out with you and wing with you, giving you feedback in real time. Daytime pickup, you're gonna be taking pictures for your Tinder profile with the instructor. Uh, we're gonna have hot girls rate the photos, rank them in terms of order, which is the best one. Um, build your profile for you in terms of the description so you have an optimized online game profile. Show you exactly what text to send to get your dates set up. Show you exactly how to run your dates, how to have the optimal um, alpha male mindsets. How to revamp your style and your wardrobe will have you go to the mall with a fashion consultant and redefine your wardrobe and upgrade your SMV, your sexual market value there. Um, we're gonna go over rotations, okay? So once you bang, close a girl, how do you keep her around? How to work volume, basically everything that's relevant to getting results, okay? All my secret sauce type stuff. How to pick up hired guns and strippers, okay? Girls that are working as bartenders, cocktail servers, etc. Um, so that's in Las Vegas. There's limited spots on that. We already have guys signed up for it and we're keeping that program uh, small. So I think there's either one, possibly two more spots on that. And email me at johnanthonylifestyle at gmail.com ASAP if you're interested in that. That's coming up in about four weeks. Then I'll be running a program in Warsaw during SOPOT Summit. Okay, SOPOT Summit, if you haven't already gotten your tickets, it's www.sopotsummit.com. It's all the underground top guys in the game, including myself. Um, that's a week long in Poland, but you can just purchase a weekend pass if that suits you better. Um, I am going to be offering live program uh, boot camps during that, just like last year. Um, when I announced it last year, it filled up like extremely quickly. So if you are going to SOPOT Summit or if you do want to train during that week, email me, johnanthonylifestyle at gmail.com, ASAP. I also have a guy coming for a 10 day program um, starting like that last weekend of the Sopot Summit. So I think it's like the 30th and the 31st of August and then going for 10 days into September. Um, there's limited spots on that as well. The seven and 10 days really get to cover the entire game comprehensively, um, fix all your sticking points, handle everything completely. Okay, so um, let's see. And there's an updated uh, boot camp schedule for some Asia tour dates and some Canada tour dates that is on the banner of this YouTube channel but I also put up the graphic on the screen and I will put the link in the description to my site which has the updated boot camp schedule um, and if you do have interest in other cities I do have coaches available to teach all around the world now message me we're ramping up the marketing efforts we're getting these coaches regularly scheduled to teach these programs these are 300 plus lake count guys have been trained by me personally they're able to run my system flawlessly and able to level up your game extremely fast, okay? So really quick, these guys are getting here any minute. The topic for the video is how to, like basically you don't ever wanna give like a negative option, like a way out, right? It sounds fucking like manipulative or whatever, but you don't wanna frame things in such a way like, hey, would you like to go home with me? Or like anything where, where they can say no, right? You're like on a date, you're like, hey, do you wanna go back to my place now? Instead, change your wording both in person, when you're talking about bringing a girl home from the club, or basically when you're giving a girl a compliance test, okay? Or bring her home from a date, or over text when you're talking about she should come straight to the house. 
you change your wording to we should or we could or let's okay so when i try to have a girl come straight to the house using the whole wind into the house sequence and you can watch my video on my channel setting first dates to the house what i say is um do you like wine they say yes okay now i'm switching it to i have like a, a coffee variation because i i haven't drank for like a month I feel fucking amazing it's awesome um pretty sure i'm done with alcohol permanently just because it has caused too many negatives across all areas of life um we can just think a lot clearer accomplish a lot more um be a lot more healthy etc do less stupid shit so anyways <laughs> Using that wine sequence, do you like wine? The girl almost always says yes. Cool, we could. Notice how the language there, not do you want to. We could split a bottle of wine at my new place and see how the chemistry is. Smiley face, do you prefer red or white? Question mark. Now that looks like you're giving them the option to back out, but note if she picks red or she picks white, both of those involve coming to your house. It's called a decision close in sales. Where if you're like, setting an appointment for a salesman as a canvasser where you're just going around and talking to people and you're like, <clears throat> um, we have appointments in the morning. I could either come or we could have the guy come at 10 o'clock or he could come in the evening at like 6 p.m., which is better for you. Notice you're not like, would you like a salesman to stop by? And that, that raises their defenses. Oh no, would you like to come back with me? Oh, and like they're gonna be like, oh fuck. Like, would you like to come over to my house? Would you like to come from my house the first date? All those things lower the probability of the girl complying with your request based on the way that you frame things, okay? Um, and then going into like more advanced topics when you're trying to get the girl to leave with you from the nightclub and she says something like, when you're like, we should go, <clears throat> Give me a moment here. You're like, we should go rip um, a couple shots and see how the chemistry is, or no, sorry. <laughs> when you're at the club, you're like, we should go rip a couple shots and, um, uh, we should go over a couple shots and we'll come right back. And then she's going to say she can't leave her friends. It's the most common objection. And you're like, don't worry, my friends are here too. I have to come back. And you're like, no, look at me. Like, I have to come back too. And if she still hasn't, you're like, no, we're like, really, I have to come back. We're going to be on like five minutes. Excuse me. You're like, we're going we're to come right back. Like, and then you, you look at her again. Hold on. Jesus. <laughs> okay. There's multiple people arriving now, so I will cut this pretty soon, but I'm getting my point across here. So we could um, split a bottle, or no, sorry, fuck, fuck all over the place. All right, so you're like, you're like, no, she's still hesitating, you're like, look at me, like, we have to come back, we're only be gone for like five minutes, and then here's like the checkmate move. This is like the opposite of saying, do you want to go to my place? You're saying like, look at me. Like, promise me we're coming back. And she's like, yeah, like, I have to come back too. And you're like, pinky promise her doesn't count. So you basically like flip the objection back on her. And now, come in. I'm just finishing up like uh, the last minute of a video. Oh, okay. But you can just chill for a sec. Um, so by doing that, you're like flipping the objection back on her. And then now she is promising you that you're gonna come back to the club. So you wanna be really careful in the way that you like frame your Requests never make it, you know, like a salesman, he's never going to say like, do you want to, do you want me to come by and, and talk to you about this tomorrow? Instead, he's going to say, look, we have availability at 10 a.m. or 6 p.m., which is better for you. Okay. When you invite the girl to your house, we can split a bottle of wine in my new place. Do you prefer red or white? Okay. When you go to leave the, the club, we should go rip some shots. Okay. And then you can flip it back on her and say like, no, promise me you have to come back. Um, look in the description. The link for Soapot Summit will be down there. Um, there was 250 attendees last year. We're expecting even more this year. Um, you can purchase either a week or just a weekend pass if you're unable to get off work or whatever. I'm also booking programs for that week. Okay, and there's already some people have signed up. There's gonna be limited spots there. But I will put the links in the description for the Vegas 10 day, the Warsaw 10 day, and then the Soapot dates. So please again, like and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you on the next video. Take care.